Maybe we don't stand a chance It's sad but it's true I'm way too good Thank you Gringo And now we go on in the program here On Inside Rob This is a place for families here. Yeah, Seems like that. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm very excited Not to just see for it. Families, but yeah, it's a nice place. Um, the employees here are indigenous of this island, actually. Oh, so it's a okay. good thing that they do. Salad, you want to try? What kind of salad? Paco, paco. You know, fern? Like a... The egg? Yes. And with eggs. Um, also egg? Mango, I think. Oh, mango. And that was palo... Pal no, it's also egg. No, this is... Palo... Palabok. Palabok. <laughs> vegan. So there's a vegan dish here in this... Restaurant, very nice. <laughs> very crunchy, very fresh. Right. Hmm. Never ate fern before. So oh, Maybe the kitchen and then the Inata tribe which is the other tribe in Northern Ridge. Mm. Mm. So even, yeah. So they're indigenous to this island, and they, they actually have their own language going on. Ooh. One more language. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. 
拜拜。And very often at the road you find these food fruit stands, and they have other stuff too. And we want to get some fruits now. So you know, it's a pine, because, pine forest. Yeah, and here's a pine forest. We have it a lot in Germany. <laughs> and you said the, many of the um, fruits come from this region, right? Yes. Because agriculture is here. Citrus. This is actually sweet. Ooh. Uh, like it's a very distinct mandarin. Mandarin, like this. Yeah. Like mandarin, cool. but not mandarin. Yeah. The pelakilo is mandarin. Yeah. This one, but it's different. Mandarin. This one, mandarin. Mandarin. Yeah, looks like a mandarin. Oh, this banana <laughs> look very nice. Red. Different sweet potatoes. Where is it? Yakon. Yakon. Oh, really? I have yakon in my garden too. Mm. It's very, very cool. Kamote. Kamote. So it's like that for the kohlrabi? It's sweet. I know. I know. I know. Ah, yeah, yeah, I have it in my garden. So. <laughs> really? Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Right. Could be a different variety. What is this? This is pizza. I think it's kind of like a persimmon. So the inside is like like a chalky. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Sweetish. Sweet dish. Okay. You know how like yeah, persimmon is like a little bit flat? This chico. Is the chico. And the bread? No, that's uh, the sour sock. Sour. You remember that? Um, ah, the juice. Yeah. yeah. Sour sock. Pomelo. You see, I no, have knowledge about it. Avocado. Cacao. Yeah. No Which? Uh, mango. No, no. What? It's... Smell it. Smell it first. No idea. No idea. Guava. Ah, guava. Okay. Guava. I'm not. I'm not the biggest guava fan. Germany over there, across okay. the border. That's Germany because they are pine trees. Mm. Okay, so this one is like, it's like a melon. Ah, they're very small. Mm. Oh, it's very small. It's very small. It's very small. It's very small. Yeah.
also on vacation I try to go to the gym and this is a very good example here how gyms often look like in Southeast Asia. So I've been to similar gyms in Thailand too and I think also in Cambodia and in Vietnam. Very big hall, a lot of equipment here available and also some freestyle stuff. There's also some volleyball here, tennis, whatever. You can climb a little bit, some freeletics, some athletics, all this stuff here possible uh, in this gym. And it, it, this costs like 300 pesos for one day for a single use. I think they have a shower. I saw a shower, but the shower was maybe not that nice that you want to use it, but it would be possible. In another gym uh, we've been yesterday, there was also a shower, a very good one. Um, so that was 500 pesos. So we have different options also here in Bakalot, Philippines. Oh, there's also something, a wall to climb. Oh! And Bacolod is also full of art. Gringo shows me something here. This is called the Bacolod Arts District. There are three galleries here, and apart from that, the whole place is filled with art. Some art. Okay. This is where my favorite um, tattoo shop is. I've had a few tattoos done here by the, for me, one of the best tattoo artists in the country. I don't know if Gallery Orange is open, but no, it's not open. Because I think we're, we've come. In, oh, the, I think everything opens here at. Hmm. It's holiday, public holiday. Maybe. No, they're open though. This is the studio? Yeah, this is where I got my tattoos. Like, uh, I got this there, this one, this one, and then this one I all got from this tattoo shop. He's the best. Good price think, also? Very good price. Like for example, this one was 3,500, so that's like 50 euro. Wow. But look at the quality of it. I mean, I don't know if it's friendly price or, but I'm sure it's not gonna be far off from that. But nonetheless, it's a pretty good deal. I will show you the best piece of artwork in this whole place. I mean, these are not bad, but... <laughs> Actually, like a bunch of artists from here were in Leipzig, Germany. Up to now, actually, from yeah, the 1st of December to the 4th of January in Kunstkraftwerk, Leipzig, Germany. Yeah, very good. Kunstkraftwerk. Mm. So all those artists are my friends. They're all really, really good, actually. Take mine's out back.
What is that? This fruit is called Chico. And yeah, have you tried this before? No, uh, uh, how does it taste? Try and let me know. I guess I don't know. I don't have any other fruit to compare it with. And how, how how do I eat it? Just crack it open. I guess like a peach, like a peach, right? This is how you open a you open peach like. Yeah. So it's kind of like a peach actually. Hey. Oh, it looks like a peach. Okay. I, I want to try it now. So it also looks like a peach inside. There are seeds also. <clears throat> mm. Oh yeah, that's very sweet. Mm. A bit like a pear, mm. a peach. Mm. Very good. I have it. Mm. I never tried it or had it in Thailand. I don't know if it is available in Thailand too, but mm. very good. Mm. That could be my favorite. The shoot away the ghosts, the badge, demons, like that.